Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to properly install a shear bolt on a Murray snowblower. I had this blower come in the other day and it's a Murray snowblower. And here's an example of a shear pin that's not installed properly. You can see the head of the bolt is sunk in right into the hole. What I'm going to do now is remove this bolt. It's actually not a true shear pin. It's a regular bolt and that's bad because if you hit something it may not break and it can cause damage to your gearbox over here. So I've got the old bolt removed. Also you want to make sure that the augers turn freely once the shear pin is off. If they don't turn freely and you hit something and even if you have a shear pin you could still cause damage to your gearbox. Now in my hand I have a new shear pin designed for this snowblower. You can see it has a little collar. You would insert it into the bolt or the shear pin. And now what you do is with the bigger hole of the auger, which this one is, if I turn it you can see the hole smaller. So it's bigger on one side. I'm going to bring it back. That's the side you want to install the bolt with the collar. The collar will fit into the hole, just like this. And then you want to go on the other side and put the nut on. Now with the 7 16 wrench, hold the nut on this side. And now you can tighten up the bolt. Now you don't want to over tighten the shear pin. I'll show you where the happy medium is. So now it's tight, I'm going to back off a bit. So basically you want the bolt to be loose like this, approximately 1 16th to 1 8th of an inch. It is a lock nut at the end of the bolt, so it's not going to come off. And by having the bolt loose like this, it's taking the pressure off the shaft and putting it onto the shear pin and the augers. Therefore, if you should hit something by accident, the shear pin will break and you will not cause damage to your gearbox. So that's the proper way to install a shear pin on the Murray snowblower. And here's how not to install a shear pin on your snowblower. Or should I say a carriage bolt. You do not want to do this. So here's how not to do it. And here's how to do it. And by the way, I'll be taking off that carriage bolt and putting in a proper shear pin. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you learned something today. Make sure to subscribe. Check out my channel for more repair videos on small engines. And I'll see you next time. Have a nice day.